New at 6 o'clock, former Charles Manson follower Leslie Van Houten might be getting out of prison after a California appeals court reinstates a grant of parole. Eyewitness News reporter Sophie Flay joins us live now in studio with more. Sophie? David, 73-year-old Leslie Van Houten is serving a life sentence for helping cult leader Charles Manson kill two people in Los Angeles in 1969. But this week, a California appeals court recommended Van Houten be let out of, let out of prison on parole. Leslie Van Houten was 19 when she and other cult members fatally stabbed L.A. grocer Leno and Rosemary LaBianca in their Los Feliz home more than 50 years ago. She is currently serving a life sentence for the killings, but this week, a California appeals court found that she should be let out of prison on parole. She has been recommended for parole five times since 2016, but rejected by California governors. And this week's appeals court ruling reverses an earlier decision by California Governor Gavin Newsom, who rejected parole for Van Houten in 2020. In Newsom's rejection, he stated that Van Houten was still a danger to society and offered an inconsistent explanation for her involvement with the Manson family at the time of the killings. But the appeals court's reverse ruling stating that there is no evidence to support the governor's conclusion, going as far to say that Van Houten has shown extraordinary rehabilitative efforts, remorse, and realistic parole plans. California Attorney General Rob Bonta could ask the California Supreme Court to stop her release. The gruesome murders were directed by Charles Manson, leader of the Manson family cult. Manson orders inspired by the Beatles song Helter Skelter, which he believed to be about a race war. The LaBianca slangs came the day after the other Manson followers, not including Van Houten, killed pregnant actress Sharon Tate and four others. Leslie Van Houten is not going to be immediately released from prison. There are still steps along the way. We expect that uh, the Attorney General, Rob Bonta, will probably appeal to the California Supreme Court, and that could take years. So even though this divided appellate court decision paves the way for Leslie Van Houten to be released, it's far from certain that she ever will be. Van Houten's attorney saying today that she will continue to fight for her release.